I have never seen the water this high, and this is my third year working here. Jackson Chilberg tends the docks in the Dunkirk Harbor. As you can see, our dock ramps here are just submerged completely for the most part. Lake Erie is 30 inches above its May average. It's the highest has been in about 30 years. And because of the economic impact these conditions can have, cities like Dunkirk can't afford the levels to rise much more. In the summertime, we depend on our fishermen and our boaters here. Now behind me, there's two different types of docks. There's floating docks that go up and down with the water level, but there is one dock that's held in place by poles. Now I'm told that dock houses a lot of the bigger boats during the summer. And if the waves start to get bigger and bigger, while this water water level is really high, there is the potential for lots of damage. And when you have a water level matching the dock, you know, windstorm, the boat could be on top of the dock by the next morning. The city has already purchased more floating docks to be installed next week, but unfortunately the concerns stretch beyond the infrastructure, especially going into Memorial Day weekend. When you have uh, currents that change uh, with the, the, the water depths going up, especially around the cliffs that we have all along the Lake Erie shoreline here in western New York. Uh, please be careful when you're swimming. Borello assured me that there haven't been any Chautauqua County beach or boat launch closings yet. So unless Mother Nature has some other plans in mind, he's staying optimistic. In Dunkirk, Sean Robson, 7 Eyewitness News.